Hello everybody. Welcome to the fifth part of this series about the dog breeds. Today I will be giving information about the otter hound dog breed. Otter hound dogs are big, mysterious and yet affectionate. The otter hounds were bred in medieval England for now banned otter hunting. This breed is known for its dense shaggy coat, webbed feet, acute sense of smell and an affinity for swimming. Otter hounds are built to be expert swimmers and this is clearly seen from the top of their rough waterproof coat to the bottom of their big webbed feet. Otter hounds have a broad chest and powerful shoulders which allow them to swim all day without getting tired. Their large black nose is amazingly sensitive and could follow an otter's underwater scent trail over great distances. The otter hound's size and strength enabled them to take on a sharp-toothed, razor-clawed otter that might weigh as much as 20 pounds. Otter hounds are generally healthy for a large breed, but like all large breeds, Otter hounds can experience bloat, which is a life-threatening condition where the stomach enlarges and sometimes twists. Owners should educate themselves about the signs of bloat and the action that is required should it occur. Otter hounds coats do need brushing once or twice a week depending on the length and texture. A good slicker brush and a medium cone can work for this. Since the otter hounds tend to drag their beard on the ground and store snacks in them, their beard may also need cleaning at the same time. Along with their beard and their coat, their nails require trimming as well. The nails can be trimmed every week or two. Otter hounds need mental as well as physical exercise. A large, securely fenced yard is a good beginning. But some hounds will lie under a tree in a fenced acre rather than self-exercise. Long walks to sniff the world and visit passers-by are good for both owners and hounds. Obedience classes, tracking and agility can help to provide mental stimulation as well as good exercise. Though otter hounds are large and strong, they can be very sensitive. So always use positive reward based training methods and praise to get the best results. Like people, otter hounds love to be told how wonderful and talented they are when they master something. Patience, praise and food is the best combination and can do wonders in training. The otter hound should do well on high quality dog food. Whether commercially manufactured or home prepared with your veterinarian supervision and approval. Any diet should be appropriate to the dog's age. That is, whether he is a puppy, an adult or a senior dog. Some dogs are prone to getting overweight. So watch your dog's calorie consumption and weight level. Treats can be an important aid in training no doubt. But giving too many can cause obesity. Learn about which human foods are safe for dogs and which are not. Check with your vet if you have any concerns about your dog's weight or diet. Clean and fresh water should be available at all times. The next few seconds of this video will give you a summary of the entire breed for better understanding. For more information, you can also visit akc.org which is the official website of American Kennel Club. If you find the information given in this video helpful, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel for information on other breeds as well. It's my sincere request to everyone, always adopt and not shop.